This is Dr. Caldwell Miller with Dr. Miller's Guide to Neurology. We've been doing a series on epilepsy. And today we're going to talk about focal automatism seizures. And you remember, I'm going to say things redundantly over and over because the classification is new. There's three seizure types. There's focal, there's generalized, and there's unknown. Unknown just means it's unwitnessed, like someone had a seizure in their sleep or they were driving a car by themselves and had a seizure. Um, and a focal automatism seizure is a focal seizure. These patients have repeated motor activity with impaired awareness. So this is one of these focal impaired awareness seizures. They occasionally have amnesia. They're very hard to diagnose um, unless they have an abnormal EEG. They can have repeated actions like saying something repeatedly, lip smacking, rubbing themselves, wandering. It's a focal impaired awareness seizure. In the old days, we call these complex partial seizures. So what would a typical focal automatism seizure? Yep. And they're sort of confused. And then they pop out of it. Um, I had one patient, and she just seemed sort of confused, popped out of it. Um, hooked her up to an EEG right after the visit, just took her straight back there, just had dozens of seizures. So that's a focal automatism seizure, and um, what we used to call a complex partial seizure. And a lot of these focal seizures we used to call complex partial seizures. We've got to learn these new names, focal automatism seizure. So that's focal automatism seizure. Um, like, comment, subscribe, and we're going to talk about more focal seizures and more um, generalized seizures with this new classification until we learn them well.